Hello everyone and welcome to Hopify Life. Today's video is about how much money I made in my very first month as a YouTube partner. If you like this type of content, please give us a like, hit that subscribe button. So stay tuned and we're gonna jump right into it. Okay, so whenever you create content on YouTube, you have to meet certain specifications to be granted access to their partnership program. And when you get to be a partner, that is when you start to be able to monetize your, your videos. By monetize, that usually means like that you're able to have ads or that you actually get money for the ads that are being shown on your videos. Um, I recently got that back on, I think, December the 12th or 13th, and today is January 14th, so I'm going to show you how much I made in that month, my very first month as being, of being a YouTube partner. So whenever you uh, get access to it, they um, immediately monetize all the videos you had previously. Now, most of my content was done before I became... A YouTube partner I think when I became a YouTube partner over the course of this month I may have made um, like four or five videos some of them videos were streaming you know gaming content and me just streaming and um, <clears throat> but the, the majority of the videos are from when I had done mostly cryptocurrency content and the videos that I did particularly well in the ones that had the most views for me were all the technical videos if I had uh, you know done a technical video on say a particular coin uh, also, how to mine that coin and how much you know you might be expected to make by mining that coin at that current time, that current difficulty with a, a GTX 1080s and 970s. So, um, I I did make some money on some past videos, and I'll show you like some astronomical uh, ad that was shown to somebody uh, on one video in particular that dealt with Coinbase. Uh, but for the most part, all of my earnings were from the videos that I created recently. Um, the couple of videos I did on Lambda School, which is a coding boot camp, uh, the one that did the best and had the most views was my review on the game Atlas, um, which is just a, essentially a reskin of a, another game called Ark. And uh, that was sort of why I created the video. I felt like, you know, we got charged a lot of money for something that was incomplete in alpha stage. Uh, but that video in particular had somewhere between 10 and 11,000 views, and I believe it had somewhere close to 2,700 to 2,800 impressions. Meaning, um, you know, if somebody didn't have ad block or didn't have the YouTube ad block, uh, they were probably shown some sort of ad. And what that ad is really determines, well, there's a lot of other things that determine how much you actually make on it, but, you know, location, who they're getting shown to, the type of ad that's getting shown. Um, if they're interacting with that ad, uh, things like that. Uh, and it counts as an impression, I believe, as long as they get shown the ad, and if they click out of the ad, then it still counts as an impression, I believe. But anybody that's got probably ad blocker and stuff, I do not believe that that counts towards um, any impressions, which obviously um, takes away from some of the cost or some of the, the revenue a uh, YouTube creator makes. But... Anyways, I'll just bring this up really quickly so that you guys can see how much I made. So from December 13th to January 13th. Uh, so December 13th, 2018. Today is the 14th, but January 13th, 2019. So my total revenue for that month and how much I've made so far as a YouTube partner is $23.84. Now this combines how much I've made on just the ad revenue and then also uh, for people that pay for YouTube Premium, I think you get some sort of small percentage. And maybe there's just not a lot of YouTube Premium um, subscribers. Uh, but you get some sort of revenue from people that watch your video based on maybe the minutes and the impressions that they get. Um, but as you can see, uh, what my revenue was, most of it came from that Atlas one. Uh, and I, my estimated says $9.71. And then most of my YouTube Premium revenue came from this video in particular as well. And then there's a few other videos, uh, I think in total, it says 39 videos uh, received some sort of revenue. Most of them are just pennies, as you can tell, just pennies here. But uh, yeah, 
Anyways, some of the, there are videos, like I think uh, one video in particular that I was talking about was that Coinbase video where I made a dollar fifty, and I'm pretty sure that the dollar fifty came on one impression. And one way for me to check that is if I go to the ad rates. So if you if you get to this point and you want to, if you're becoming a YouTube partner and you wanted to check how much revenue you get, um, you you actually do receive these revenue reports, and they tell you you know roughly how much you've made over the course of that time and most of the time it's usually a day or two behind on you know particular revenue so anyways ad rates um this sort of goes through the cpm um and how many clickbacks you get and uh, as you can see that there are particular days where i've made more and obviously most of the days where i've made less um and then it also breaks down how much you you made you know accordingly so, like I said, this Coinbase one in particular, it says two dollars and seventy-two cents, and the monetized playbacks was actually three dollars. Now, YouTube also, as far as you have to calculate this in, uh, I believe they take forty-five percent. Uh, I've heard like twenty-five percent, but I think it's forty-five percent um, because uh, the ad revenue total is almost forty-two dollars, and I'm making twenty. I think twenty-three, almost twenty-four dollars. So. That's how much uh, I've gotten. And the total amount of estimated monetized playbacks over the course of the month has been 3,400. So um, for me in particular, I'm pretty small uh, as far as uh, you know, a YouTube channel goes. I'm still growing. I'm under 3,000 subs. Um, I do have some videos that have done pretty well up in, like I said, the 35,000 uh, playback or views and you know, 10,000, 12,000. But for the most part, you know, I'm closer to a thousand or under views uh, as far as how many views you know my videos make but I had just recently made a change from making content strictly about cryptocurrency and cryptocurrency news to uh, more broader things you know I like to do book reviews I like to do game reviews um, I like to do technical reviews on uh, electronics um, things like that so anyways uh, one way to check how much you're making on particular clicks so like whatever ad is being shown to the user um, that is how much these could be and as you can see the one that was given to coinbase someone paid twenty seven hundred dollars and I think twenty seven hundred dollars means twenty seven hundred dollars per one thousand views of that particular ad so and it only got shown I believe one time on my videos but um, as you can see here, the Atlas one is the one that had 2,800 um, monetized playbacks. And because 2,800, I only got $17.65. You can see that the actual ad that's being shown wasn't worth very much. I mean, I, I wish that it was the $2,700 one that was being shown there because then obviously my revenue would be somewhere closer to, I don't know, um, you know, six or $7,000. But uh, yeah, so I'm not in, uh, entirely sure. I don't have all the information. I have no idea what ad was shown um, in, the, in particular to this this individual. I don't know where they were from. I don't know any of that information because I don't know when that was when that exact uh, you know ad was seen. So, I mean, I have a very YouTube is good about giving you a lot of statistics. Uh, but it's usually not user based. You're not getting like exact user. This person watched this for X amount of time from this location. You get a general idea of, okay, you're getting people from this demographic, from this general area, region, uh, and so on. But anyways, as you can see, this day in particular, for whatever reason, uh, it might even be the same person. Uh, they saw two different videos and someone paid the, a lot of money for that uh, particular ad to be seen. But anyways, that's really about it. Um, I don't want to keep this too long. I just wanted to share with you and be, you know, transparent with how much I've made. Um, my plan is to make more videos over the next next month. Um, in particular, I'm going to be doing a couple more book reviews of things that I've read uh, early in 2019. Uh, the first book review I did was uh, Simon Sinek's uh, Together is Better, which I could put a card up if you guys want to watch it. Um, and I'm actually doing another Simon Sinek uh, review, which it's going to be start with why um, I'm actually going to be making that video after this video so that should be out maybe tomorrow or the next day um, anyways I hope that you enjoyed this video I hope that it was sort of um, information that you guys can apply to you know if you want to be a YouTube um, you know person if you want to make content for somebody um, you obviously uh, the more you grow 
uh, and the content that is specific to you or whatever whatever you're making could make more money or less money depending on the ads that are shown uh, and the demographic that you have. Uh, there's a lot of factors that go into the type of ads that are actually shown to your audience. So, um, but for particular from my standpoint and for the limited videos that I did make, uh, this is how much money I made uh, in total. Obviously from $42 I'm going to get a cut of $23.84. So maybe I'll go buy some lunch. All right, see you guys later. See you in the next video. Bye. I'm flying.